Hey everyone. Hello, welcome. I'm Momo. I'm Izza. And we're Anthropola Kitty, and we're about to start playing a Let's Play of Horizon Zero Dawn. <laughs> Yay! So thank you to everyone who voted on what we should play next. There were two that came first equal one, so we thought we'd just start with this one. Yeah. Um, and we're really excited. Uh, I've seen a little bit of it. Yeah, I think we've both seen about an, like an hour or so. But before then, I, I oh, started okay. watching a Let's Play of it years ago, but I've forgotten everything. Um, and, yeah, for those who are new to our channel, we mm -hmm. try to read out any non-spoken dialogue so that you don't have to look at the screen the whole time if you are got this playing in the background while you're doing your dishes. Yep. Uh, Our style of play is kind of a mishmash because we both have slightly different play styles. But um, Yeah, I'm a bit more completionist and is this a bit more just get us to the fucking point. <laughs> so we kind of end somewhere in between. Which I think is a nice balance. Yeah. 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 Um, and we're, we're very much a... Just, you know, fuck around and, and find see, out. fuck around and find out. Um, so that just means that sometimes we get in ourselves into interesting situations. But and I it's blind, adds to really, that. essentially. So we're not looking <laughs> up. We only look up stuff if um, we Extreme get really frustration. stuck. Yeah. yeah. Um, so that's the sort of way we play. Um, and I, if that sounds good to you, then I hope you'll join us. Welcome aboard. Yeah. Let's, so we, um, are going to play the intro movie and then begin the game. Yeah. So let's find out what happens. Ooh, I'm excited. Have you turned up a bit, my dear? Beautiful. What's that now? Don't like the cold? Bubba. Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. The halo of hair on the baby's head. Here. Wear this. It's funny now that this is like. My daughter. I mean, it's not an old game, but it's not Good. a brand new game anymore, right? Um, when did it come out? Today, oh, I speak that. your name, girl. <laughs> You're asking the hard questions. But will the goddess speak it back? Oh, it's so pretty. It is very pretty. So, uh... For people who aren't familiar, while we play, uh, is this husband's is Normally often... Normally it would be the mother who declares... Gaming in the background. If you had one. The whole village would attend, and matriarchs perform the ritual. But... Okay. We are outcasts. Oh. Why? What they Even do? so, mean? we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. Statue's interesting, eh? But their wickedness doomed them. To us, tanks were left tanks. the splendors of creation. Beasts of air, water, earth, and steel. I immediately have a lot of questions. I know, right? <laughs> it is one thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this one day. So he said they're outcasts in that. So it, the, the implication is that these guys aren't related by blood, right? Because he was like, I, this belongs to my daughter when he put the oh, yeah. thing on her. How can a baby be an outcast? It's pretty a ridiculous notion, isn't it? Hi, Matriarch Tirsa. Not that it what happens, is she doing just here? the notion. Does she mean to forbid the ritual? She's got a great hat. She does have a great hat. No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes, 
You may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you? Ah. We, we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... <laughs> I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then yes. You honor us. Yes, yes, now go and be ready to declare. Go. I like that sort of no nonsense. <laughs> go do the thing. <laughs> oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name. Aloy! And so her name is blessed. Yee, stop Kay. this at once! What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough. And you... Blessing its name like it was one I know my duty to them tribe. and to you. Without consultation, oh, I'm here, year, and wherever you go, I will follow. I love how he's just like ignoring the, the ranting drama. that's happening in the background. <laughs> my little baby, I will take care of you. <laughs> like, I'm particularly so spiteful that I'll make someone take care of you, but be like, no, you're not allowed to like a baby. <laughs> How dare you love a child. <laughs> <laughs> so what I was saying before is, is his husband is extremely excited about us playing this game. Yes. So, uh, you, yeah. may, you may hear interjections potentially. <laughs> so um, let can. us, uh, we've watched that. Let's, let's begin. Um, what are we doing? Well, this is interesting because uh, we've played different games, have a variety of different difficulties, and we've sometimes moved it up and moved it down. Um, shall I just have a quick check and see if we can move it up or down during? Uh, We're getting a normal is fine from the hus base. Okay, should we just go with normal? Normal is probably good. Um, yeah. Fuck it. Fuck it. <laughs> Usually these days you can change it later if you... you Yes. Uh, so find yourself getting stuck. Uh, uh, with the machines, I have so many questions just from that. Right? <laughs> Which is... Earth, the far future. Nature has reclaimed the ruins of our forgotten civilization, but humanity lives on in primitive tribes. In this new wilderness, they fight for survival against the machines, fearsome mechanical creatures of unknown origin. Okay, well, then, pff, there goes my unknown origin. Dang, I'm not... <laughs> <laughs> You're not so, going to get an answer to that question straight yeah, away. Yeah, which a... is, where do they come from? How are there so many of them? Are they building themselves? How does that all happen? Yeah. Great questions. Are they building themselves? How do they reproduce? How do they reproduce? Who made them in the first place and why? And why are they now animals, essentially? But somehow creating more of themselves. Maybe. Maybe. Somehow it would have to be being generated from somewhere. Yes. Is this going to buy a new computer next year? <laughs> Just for the record. If yeah. you were wondering why we're still on the screen, loading screen 10 hours later. Uh, yeah, I can't, I can't afford a new computer quite yet, but next year, next year. Is this got a bathroom to fix first? Fuck. Aloy! Six years later, Aloy! okay. Little baby Aloy. There's now a small child Aloy. And wants some plans. Louise! Oh, that's a lot of berries. You're quite the gatherer, aren't you, little bast? Now go and see if you can find some more, hmm? Cute. Oh, well done. That's a good boy. Children, come with me. Why is she an outcast? She's an outcast to be shunned. Oh, there. Oh, 
Come on. Kind of treating her like she's almost dangerous, eh? Not quite, but kind of yeah, be around yeah. her. Oh shit. Control of the game. A new main quest, a gift from the past. Go rest? into the cave. Ugh. Thank goodness it isn't a brand oh. new game. It's not a brand new game because my computer would not handle it. <laughs> Whoa. Spoopy. Yeah, well, I was going to say it's hard to believe that no one's been down here, Looks right? It's tight, but I can get through. Through here or through there? There, I reckon. Press square to toggle crouch. Okay. Huh. Okay. I keep wanting to turn my witcher senses on. World. Oh. One of the old places. Do we have a just a wee like yes? I just want to have a look around at the ceiling and stuff. Mm. I literally keep pushing. L2 to turn my witcher senses on. Oh. <laughs> What's in this environment? Okay, so this is from the old world. The metal something, rather. Little Aloy fit through here. Ross said oh. never go in places like this. Oh, well, you Control haven't got much of an I have to find a way out. Oh, it's scary. What's this? Is that a desk? Oh, that's interesting. Some chairs. It's kind of interesting that, like, the ancient world is more familiar to us than mm. their world is to to us yeah i was thinking that it, i'm quite intrigued about how the world came to be the way fucked it is fucked up right yeah, yeah. or Ooh. well our, our, our perception is that it's fucked up but maybe it's not you know how do i get through there there's a strange um, device can you push no you can't do anything <laughs> i don't i don't have would you push <laughs> um as a six-year-old child But not just how it came to be this way, but how people came to forget what it all meant. Yeah. <laughs> there is something up ahead. Anyway. Oh. Those bats are having a party. I was yeah, having a great time. Yes. Bat party. I agree. Bat party. What's that? A dead person. Where? Oh, oh in the centre. Is that a person? I can't oh find. shit. Okay, fell down oh, there. There's a person. There's something shiny there. Do you think if you saw a corpse on the ground, is it, you'd be like, I see something shiny on it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna take go it. pull this flashing object off the skull of a corpse. Absolutely not. I know better. <laughs> I mean, you're not a six-year-old. I think a six-year-old probably would. Yeah, probably. Depending on how scared they were. Yeah. Would I? I don't know. It depends. If I was desperate, maybe. <gasps> oh. Oh.
Did it just snap to her head? That's interesting. Mm. Lights. Oh, it's, it's augmented reality. Mm. How cool. does it do this? I thought that said toggle the fuck. <laughs> toggle the fuck out of everything. Uh, toggle R3. the focus. Is that is the focus the the net around us? I guess so. Hmm. Can I interact with any of these objects? Okay, so she automatically walks slowly when I've got that on. Are there lots of terminals around? Huh. Oh, I just walked over the corpse. Sorry! <laughs> I don't think they care. I've been dead a long time. Presumably. Um, oh, I see a waypoint. And something red and scary. A metal door. Closed. Maybe this device I found can help. Maybe it can, Aloy. Ooh. Bunker door. Blast door. Heavily shielded. Seal integrity maintained. Power status off. What are we a looking shape. at? shape. It's connected to the door somehow. Can you read that out for me, Isa? Because yeah. I am too far away. Code Nexus. Secure encryption port with holographic display. Data shows required settings for nearby hollow locks. Locks. Okay, More so it's... Lights. Yeah, what's that? What's that? Power cable. Hollow lock. Electromagnetic security mechanism with standard holographic UI interface unavailable. Oh, can we get to this somehow, or can we access it from here? I think maybe. Sorry for the, the next bump room? on the mic, friends. If you can hear that, it's just my cat is on my lap. <laughs> and you know the rules. So, Anthropolokitty is named as such because we're both anthropologists, and we have cats <laughs> and we have cat we, we're obsessed with cats so. so why not i'm not loving the fact that there's a rat just hooning around with me do you want to touch it no i really don't <laughs> actually thanks it... Isa, for your suggestion oh, so can okay. i touch this can i oh oh turn the hollow lock counterclockwise or clockwise well, are there marks on it there oh yeah that's interesting oh, oh. Okay. Changed colour. That was the easiest puzzle in the world. Touch it twice. Yeah. <laughs> Do I need to interact with this thing? Yeah, that may as well, right? Nope. You should, you, you, if you're not, like, in there. Do you know how you went up to that one and pushed, like, square or whatever? But you couldn't do that to the, that one? No, I okay. couldn't. Cool, cool, cool. They all look so intriguing. I want to touch every... I know, right? I want to, like, interact with every interface. But I, I don't think they do anything. No. I tried Door to... Door change colour too. Good sleuthing, Aloy. Amazing. Ooh. It did it. What a little smarty kiddo. Yeah, those people who outcast her don't know what they're fucking missing out on. There's a... A green thing Strange here. object in there. There's a terminal to your left as well. I don't know. It looks like there's a... Do you see that on the left? A little symbol? Oh. I don't Hang quite on. know. If I yeah. Can put my thing over it. Okay. Alright. Well, uh -huh. I'm just curious. Yeah, no, it looks like it's supposed to make a noise, right? Well, it looks like a sound, doesn't it? Cannot interact with it. Oh, this is good though, because it's like the Witcher senses. So. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so my desire for the Witcher senses has proved rapidly. It's, it's been to born be out. <laughs> yeah. What's that? What is that? Is it more? Oh, it's Another more people. It's got a device. Oh. You think I want it this way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. <laughs> Look, 
Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! Hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. <laughs> Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Happy birthday, Was the symbol Isaac. back on that terminal Daddy that same sure symbol? Daddy sure does love his little big man. What symbol? This one? Yeah, that that little... Was that what was on the terminal? No. Okay, anyway. Let's go and clamber over all these dead bodies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let me into the side rooms. Nice. Squeeze through the gap. Oh, oh. Oh, can't get out that way. Whoops. At this point, I'm basically just following the waypoint. Although, side room. But you have to wonder if there's other stuff around. Although, has it? Oh. Yeah, that symbol. That was the symbol we saw, right? Yeah, it was. Can we do anything with it now? Don't seem to be able to. Hmm. Well, Happy New Year, dear diary. Can you believe we actually celebrated last night? Well, we did. Kind of. Director Evans invited everyone to gather in the community room. Don't know where she got the party hats. That was a ghoulish touch. So there we sit, watching the clock tick down to midnight, and I'm thinking, am I the only one who gets the symbolism of this? It might have been worth it Is if Skyler had gotten drunk again, but... I seem to be a mistake she doesn't want to repeat. Hmm. I saw them lining up in the community room. Like cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Shauna handing out meds like being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Well, not me. I don't want to go quiet. What happened I don't want to wanna trail off. I want a period at the end of my life sentence, not an ellipsis. Hell, <laughs> an exclamation mark. So if that upsets whoever finds this, too bad. I don't know anyone, anything, anymore. You do? Oh. Okay, well. Shot themselves? That's what happened to that guy. Well, I was about to say, um, you do have to wonder what happened because there are bodies all over the place, which you... Right. Yeah, they haven't like died in a uh, a way where people were able to deal with the bodies the way that human beings normally deal with bodies. Right, and looks like it wasn't like, their natural lifespan. <sighs> yeah. So it sounds like, at least from that last person, that maybe there was some sort of reason they were either trapped here or there was some sort of apocalypse happening. Hmm. Oh, there's more. Why did they die here? I mean, seriously. What happened to them? Record our thoughts for posterity. Great idea, Director Evans. Like, I haven't done enough for posterity already. Like, I wouldn't be here like this if not for posterity. I'm done with posterity. Posterity can go. Yeah. Okay. And Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. Never did. Why didn't I go with Owen when he asked? Stupid. And they obviously knew that their well. deaths were coming. Mm. Mm. And maybe 
maybe that's all I need, you know? That moment the door opened and you were standing there wearing that retro wave dress and the way you smile. I had to look away or you were gonna see on my face what had just blossomed inside me, you know? It was just an instant, but I knew. I knew we'd be forever. I'm um, interested that, like, the bodies are not, like, in a peaceful state. No, that looks quite tortured, doesn't it? Which is, like, what happened? Like, did they run out of air? Did... Well, I, uh, yeah, I see. It looks like they've been... Um, not yet. Yeah, like, they've had some other trauma. If, mm. I wouldn't say air, yeah, but it could be poison or something that's caused them to be in pain, right? Let me listen to this person. I'm uh, interested in all the different. Um... And pray for us sinners. Now sorry. And at the hour I was just death, tapping I mean, the button. Death. I'm sorry. It's been a while. And, well, these meds Johnny gave us are really something. So, uh, okay, from the top, kids. <clears throat> Hail Mary, full of grace. Um, uh, the way that different people are... Sorry, I really didn't mean to do that. Always wanted to see that. <laughs> Triangle again. Um, the way that different people are facing their own end. Yeah. Mm. <gasps> Rust! He found me. Rust found me. Down here. I'm coming. I'm coming! That was a fun adventure. Oh, mother be praised. A little bit morbid. But... Come, girl. Take my hand. You don't belong down there. Come! <sighs> Such places are forbidden, Aloy. I fell in. They are of the metal world. What is that on your face? Nothing. <laughs> Did you find it down there? No. <laughs> Give it to me. Little children trying to lie. No. Aloy, such things are dangerous. No! I mean, he's wearing pieces of metal on him. Mmm. <sighs> Well, if you're going to go sneaking away from home, you'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. But starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. Tutorial time! <laughs> Tutorial time! Oh. All these shapes. What do they mean? Take your bow. Huh? Bow? And enough muttering to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. I'm interested in how much time has passed because uh, between the metal world and this world, mm, mm -hmm. because they obviously all speak the same language. The wild she was can able be to dangerous, understand Aloy. all of the. You will need to stay close messages. and do as I say. I know. Now you're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday, so let's start there. Take this medicine pouch, and I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called salve brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Gather. See, I hadn't um, thought that. Good. Now eat the berries. Oh, okay. Press up there. They may taste bitter. <laughs> that was cute. But they can save your life. 
always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Okay. Where are we? This valley is just a part of All Mother's embrace. Embrace. The Nora tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. I was just thinking about Aloy and uh, using her interface and you said she could understand it. I don't think she did. Not really. I don't think she was reading it. Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines. No, like when and I will the, teach from the audio logs. Are they dangerous? All machines oh, are dangerous, Aloy. Yes, 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 yes. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Yes, fair. Okay, yeah. Or at least it's... Yeah, no, it sounded mm. the same, right? Aloy, a machine's coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. There. Now stay low. Little one. No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now keep low, and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Oh, I don't like it! We're so exposed! Okay. Oh, another one. Let it pass. Which side is it on? I don't know. Oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah. This would be a fun game to do with VR. Oh, you'll be right about that. Come. Back this way. The machine's interesting, all sinewy. The slower you move, the quieter you'll be. And crouched walking is quieter than upright. Wait for it. Whoa. Wait for Oh, where is it? <laughs> I was trying to be slow. That's the last of them. Let's move on. I'm like, I don't want to go anywhere without well. long grass they now. didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. Okay. The herd. Do you say the herd? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who's that? Ignore him. But why is he up there? He's smiling at us. Tab! Get back where you belong! Tab! Where are you? Ignore him. We are outcasts and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. <laughs> And he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Well, it Follow. does seem like life is hard outside of the tribe, right? Well, especially when everyone's being a dick to you all the time. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, ooh. Take it, take it, take it, take it. Yes! Fuck. Oh, yes. We're going to be able to gather all the shit in here. <laughs> I'm so excited. What's our new hand fiber? Is that? Oh, no. And how big are our pockets? This is there. exciting. See them? These are called striders. I don't care, I just want this herb. Ha! Get! Oh, so they're not, they won't attack? Hey. Why'd you chase them off? <sighs> to show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Okay. Is there stuff all over the ground that you can pick up? I think up? so. Mm, <laughs> Is this like... Oh, it's a rock. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. How many rocks Those can I do. gather? Follow. But, but what if I want more? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I'm not going to pick up more rocks. <laughs> Just completely burden ourselves with rocks. 
<laughs> Momo, I'm not going to pick up any more Morocks. <laughs> Immediately picks up, picks more, up rocks. more rocks. Stop wasting time. What? Where is he? I don't even know where he is. Is, it, is that where he is up there? I don't know. I'm just following the way. Are you hey, slow like, because of the rocks? I don't know. <laughs> I think I'm just slow because I'm a kid. Yeah, yeah. Hey, okay, like, fair. come now. Oh. There's the herd. All right. It's time to throw some rocks. I mean, kids but love to throw can't rocks. Hurt machines, rocks. Right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Okay. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy, unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. I'm scared. I just want us to look at the watcher's tiny little legs for a bit. Where is it? There, look. Tiny tiny. It's like a chicken. Aloy, throw a rock Wait, near oh me. Shit, where is he? I don't know where he is. He's because... down by that little okay. symbol. Throw a rock to draw the watcher towards me. Uh. Gonna show us something. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Rust human. At least we know he's human. <laughs> there. Come, girl. It's safe now. Oh, we can loot the watcher carcass. This is this is great. Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Hold to search watcher. Metal shards and a sparker. Okay. Good. Now, gather stalks of ridgewood from the plants over there. Okay. These ones? Oh, yeah. Do I have infinite pockets is the question on my mind right now. Oh, I hope we have infinite pockets. I'd be so excited about all the collecting. <laughs> Use the stalks as arrow shafts and metal shards for arrowheads. What? L1 to open the weapon wheel. It's quite, uh, the screen is quite small and far away from my face. Just for sorry, record. friends. Uh, X is craft. Oh, nice. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Can I craft more? Oh, nice. Okay. That looks like maximum capacity. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Okay. I will follow you. <laughs> okay, what are we doing? Who are we shooting? We're crouching? We're crouching. Here, stay low on the grass and be quiet. Strider, blaze canister, we weakness something? Hmm. Aloy, it is time to make your first kill, Aloy. Okay. The Strider, one of the weaker machines. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter, if she's careless. Ooh. You must study your prey. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Like its eye. Can you guess another? The thing on its back. R3 and scan the strider. R2, tag the target. R3? The canister on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed me. What, that plaything? Stop playing games. Now, take down that strider. Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to roll out of the way. Has it taught us to roll? L2. Hold R2 while aiming to draw the bow. At full draw, your bow is a lot more accurate. Oh, yeah. Hard to see the thing. Keep firing! <gasps> it's coming. Maybe we should play this on the Keep keyboard. Keep firing! It's designed for a uh, controller. Totally, but it's also going to be a lot more easy to target things. It's not too bad. Okay. You did well today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. That was great. What was that? The boy. 
The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy, quick. I didn't even hear that. Uh, press L3 to sprint. I heard it in the background, but I wouldn't have registered it unless, you know. What a beautiful evening to be chasing some yells. <laughs> you don't have to push and hold it, by the way. Oh, you can just set it on? Yeah. Nice. Do we have stamina? Does that run out? Or do we just run forever? Seems like we can just run forever. We're so fit. Yeah, I was just checking that I was still sprinting. I mean, we are only six. We have very short legs. True. And, and infinite lungs. <laughs> oh, no! oh, shit. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh he's shit. Super dead. Oh, he's not dead. <sighs> well, if he doesn't shut the fuck up, he will be dead. <laughs> Maybe we can... He's broken everything in his body, away. but he needs to shut the Do fuck up. Nothing. It's only a matter of time before the machines find that boy and kick him to death. But if I shoot, it'll cause a stampede and they will trample him. But I can see the path they take. Stop telling stories. So he's in the grass at the moment? Yeah, they haven't seen him yet. I can sneak through. You will not. Come on, Eli. She's going to do it anyway. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> oh, no. Eli. You made it worse. Yeah. Yes, but he, he doesn't know. He thinks she's about to go off and die, right? Yeah, I know. And hey, potentially we're about to die. <laughs> but um, we're allowed to take Aloy's side because yes. Aloy is the protagonist, even That's if she right. is six and doing stupid shit. Okay. Uh, so she said she could see the path. What is that? Whoa. What? Oh. Tag a target. When the watcher is scanned, press R1 to tag its patrol path. Right. So okay. I assume that's what the arrows are. I need to do this slowly and quietly. Okay, so he's going to turn around. I think you might be able to get him behind him, right? That's not even his patrol path, because he's not even on it. Well, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yeah, yeah, he is. Oh, okay, I see, I see, I see. And I would guess you can rump on out behind him. But you have to, it's, it's a little bit. Can't let them see me. Oh, sticks. Yeah, get some sticks. <laughs> so you have to tag it to be able to see its patrol path. You can't just see its patrol path, right? I think so, yeah. Okay, so there's one, to, is that one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. And where are we going? Over there in front of us? I presume so, because that's where the yellow thingy is. And um, we don't think the other ones care about us, do we? The these guys on the left. I think we don't want them to see us, but I don't think they're as aggressive. So do we have to get into the grass on the right, or can we go straight across? I think we can go over there. So maybe go, go, go. Fuck, I'm too slow. Got to be careful. Give me this herb. Nice. More sticks. Oh, where is he? Over there. Okay. Are we going across the water? Or do we need to go around? I think we have to go through the water. Hmm. Alright. But maybe... Mm, I feel Can nervous we? about this. I need to see their paths. Yes. Oh, shit. Aloy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Almost there. Okay. <laughs> Me, I'm not helping at all. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to come back in front of me. And I think I can hone over Go, go, there. go. Yeah. Get out of the way, weird bird. Oh, it's just a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> no, I stand by it. It's a weird, weird bird. Weird bird. I mean, in that situation, that bird absolutely would have run away. <laughs> or there he is. Hi. Hi. Hey. What? How, how is this? Shh. Follow me. 
Oh my gosh, after this we can have a cup of tea. Did you eat, guys eat that ice cream that I left in your freezer? No, I didn't know there was ice cream in your freezer. Oh, freezer. Yeah, from Momo has that for us over the weekend. You left us ice cream? I'm so excited. Avoid them. <laughs> so where are we? We're this way. Okay. Is there anything? So. Oh. Maybe tag that one, eh? Hmm. Oh, he's coming real close. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. This is not nice. This How is not are you nice. doing this? Shut up! <laughs> this guy's gonna get us killed. Like, if we die, this is his fault. <laughs> I mean, it was anyway, but I, I do think Ooh. this is his fault. Ooh. How is this possible? Shut up, Shut up man! <laughs> <laughs> Can we save it? Fuck. Is there another one right now? No, no, no. Okay. Oh! <gasps> Oh, it's so much easier coming back. <laughs> He's mad but proud, right? Yeah. Proud mad. Proud. Proud. <laughs> so, it is no plaything. Wait. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. She, Boy! She saved me. I, I just wanted... Boy! Seal your lips. And they really hate they us. They are outcasts both. And she is motherless. <gasps> Do you think her mum died in childbirth? Come now. Maybe. Back to mother's heart. That would Maybe be... that's why she's an outcast. Well, I, I was going to say... Uh, you... <laughs> In a world where I'm presuming they don't have a lot of... That boy should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. So, we know that without not a medicine... I know the way. Oh, Ayla, it's all right. It's not all right, but it's, yeah. Seal your lips, boy. Seal your lips. Seal your lips, boy. Seal your lips. Stay away, no mother. You fucking cunt. <sighs> Throw it back. Oh, am I gonna get a choice? Yeah, do it. Fuck this guy. Oh, flashpoints offer moments of emotional choice. How Aloy expresses her personality is up to you. Cho choose. Punch and Aloy will confront at the challenge directly. Choose brain and Aloy will use her insight to find a clever, less obvious approach. Choose uh, heart. heart. It was something about compassion. What do you want me to do? <laughs> I want to fuck his... Aim for his head. I want to fuck his face up. <laughs> <laughs> Aloy, hey, we cannot. I... <laughs> I would have liked to have chosen the not the compassion, the the thoughtful, the one, thoughtful but one. Also, oh, wait, fuck them. Because <laughs> I think the thing that's really sticking with me is that, like, let me have a look. Even if your tribe's rules are Here, certain, people are outcasts under certain okay. circumstances. Why? You don't have to be cruel. Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. When is the Who time? Was my mother. Aloy, I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? Yes, Aloy, go to them. <sighs> it's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me. The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Oh, we better fucking win that. Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. 
<laughs> Whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard. And it'll take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. <laughs> Cute. So um, I was reflecting on the no mother, you know, motherless thing. Oh, yeah. Montage. So I don't, surely it can't just be that her mother died out in childbirth, therefore she's cursed or an outcast. Because without good health care, lots of people die in childbirth. Yep. So there would be shit tons of people or, you know, parents died in childbirth. So I just... Surely that can't be the reason. It's somewhat common. Even with good health care, people die. Yeah. Interesting. I, I guess I don't think we know enough to know, but I think your theory is a very good one. Hmm. But we don't know how big the tribes are. Maybe the tribes are only... 30 people and so she's the one outcast from death and childbirth I don't know I just feel like it seems like it's something more significant than that though it doesn't does, it does doesn't it yeah maybe her mother did something maybe her mother did something where's Great her dad job, really. like why is it only the mother's problem yeah oh fuck ah someone calling my sister <laughs> I'll call her back Gotta finish this montage. Oh, she just turned into an adult. Oh, sorry, I was just looking at my sister's <laughs> So <chair>. was I. <laughs> cool. It's all grown up. Yeah. Doesn't need protecting from those guys anymore. No. He's all, he's got all gray. Ah. Oh. Rost. Your house is quite big, eh? Yeah. Rost. Rost. Where is he? Two days before the proving, and he goes off without me. He wouldn't do that. Okay. So, so I think that might be a good spot to stop. I totally agree. Um, but we're gonna go. We've got skill points. Yeah. Oh, well, let's do that in the next episode. Um, I say, as you like, let's fucking go. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just wanted to see what they were. Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> no, no, we'll, we'll do it in the next episode. Uh, but I just wanted to, s it was like press this button to unlock them. I was like, what are they? <laughs> what do they look like? Um, cool. Oh, we've got menus. <gasps> There's a map. Oh, the map's like semi 3D. That's cool. Oh, I like that a lot. That is neat. They're one-upping Zelda on that regard. They are. So, friends, I hope you had fun um, with us sort of starting to get into the story. I think we've probably got a little bit more... Um, Intro-y stuff yeah, to get through. Ahead yeah, of us. Now that we're a grown-up. Uh, but, yeah, that was cool. I, I'm, I'm very intrigued. Yes, same. Yeah. Let's go fly a kite. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, friends, there are a kite in this game. Who knows? We'll find out. <laughs> We're going to go have a cup of tea. I hope you all... And some ice cream. Yes. Get yourself some ice cream and we'll catch you next time. See you then. Bye.